Alright, we should be back. Are we back, chat? Am I live again? That was nuts! What the fuck, dude? In all- in all my years of streaming, in all my years of streaming, I've never seen that error message. I've never seen that error message. OBS, like, it- it, like, it was like, it's like, error 49992, and then just everything shut down. I didn't touch anything, and everything just forcefully shut itself down. That was nuts. Yeah, also, All Might could beat Baki ass, bro. Um, yeah, dude, I'm, Baki literally punched the shit out of my stream. Alright, that's weird. Alright, well, anyways, moving on. I learned my lesson. Alright, uh, for anybody else, can you just uh, tell the rest of your fellow chatters to refresh because we're back? The only dumb thing is now it's going to take so long because i got to stitch the first half and the second half of the stream together for the highlights. But whatever, that's fine. You didn't miss much anyways. So now it's going to be a bitch to get the highlight video because now i got to stitch two pieces of the VOD back together. But whatever, that's fine. It's Resident Evil time. It's the last time I talk about Baki. the hell? Something weird's going on. Why is my audio so... There we go, never mind. I'm going nuts. Let's just play, alright? Talk to this compadre. Forget your makeup or something? What an asshole! Okay, dude! <laughs> Fuck you! Oh my gosh, I don't remember him saying that. Couldn't even hear him. What did you, you call me? What's the matter? Did you lose your nerve? What the fuck? Also, does anybody else think it's a little weird that like Leon just like goes guns blazing? You know? He doesn't keep it on his like hip. He doesn't like doing that stuff. He just walks with a big ass pistol. Also, you have a knife, but like if you use the knife in this game, you're pretty much... Unless you use it to like open up stuff. I don't remember it controlling like this, but... <laughs> oh, here we go. Alright, it's month of horror time. Now, this game can be pretty difficult. No, he was a rookie in Resident Evil 2. He's had six years of FBI training. It is no longer an excuse. Also, there's rumors that they're going to be that Capcom's going to be remaking this game, and I am very curious how that's going to go. So, hey, what a good way to refresh for a month of horror before the inevitable remake comes up. Uh, excuse me, sir. Sir. I heard about the Resident Evil movie. I saw the trailer and I got so tired and bored from just the trailer that like I didn't want to watch it. I don't even know what that means, dude. I probably just said like a whole bunch of like racist shit. <laughs> oh shit! Freeze! I said freeze! I got this whole game memorized, bro. I haven't even played it. Okay, uh, time to remember the controls. Hey, sir. Uh, don't. Just, just, sorry, buddy. <laughs> bro, put the, put the axe down, bud. We can talk this over. You get your dinner now? But we got this motherfucker coming at me. Oh, what? The guys are abandoning me? Oh, great, we got Grandpa Jim coming up to the shack. <laughs> Shit. Shit. <laughs> also, I love how, like, they, they just blatantly rip off Metal Gear for these codec okay? things. You're Snake, how, how are you doing? I no choice but to neutralize him. There are still others surrounding I... I've just, I've just arrived in Spain for four days, or four minutes, and I already had to neutralize a civilian. Okay, I'm, uh, I'm with Leon in this. I don't care who you are, I don't care if we just met, you're my best friend, or I don't give a shit. If you coming at me with an axe, you're getting blasted, buddy. He's not a zombie. <laughs> Look at him, he's just fucking dead on the ground. He's dead ass, bro. He got his family reunion out the window, I don't see him, though. Oh, there's a guy outside. Okay. 
Well, he's now that he's just taking a nice little dirt nap. Um, he's not a good guy. Look at look what he's got under his staircase, bro. Freaking human skulls and maggots. Looks like they killed a lot of people. Dude, he was doing the genocide run. I hope Ashley's okay. If I saw that, I would be like, I would just call up the president and be like, your daughter's dead. She's gone. I'm out of here, bud. No way. No, 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 no. Dude, the guy's got like seven skulls in his freaking seven skulls at Freddy's, dude. I'm not messing with that. Oh, great. Here we go. Oh, uh, hey, dude. Jeez, I didn't see the other guy right there already. Yes, awesome. Taking damage already. Is there, is there only two? Is there a third? There's a... I'm stuck at this. Yeah, I love Resident Evil, but I'm getting my ass whooped. Can't we just talk? Nah, I'm trying to do pacifist run. <laughs> Son of a bitch. He's saying, what the fuck are you doing? Leave here? Is that what he said? Thank you, Acid. Acid's the translator for Resident Evil 4, because I don't know what the hell these guys are talking about. All I hear is like, Matalo! Which I think what means kill him or get him or something. <laughs> I don't know. Something like that. Give me some money. Hello? See? Kill him. See, I know something about Resident Evil. Yeah, that's what I thought. That guy kind of looks like my grandpa. May he rest in peace. The guy and in real life. <laughs> Alright. Let's get some weed, dude. Don't tell Pop. He'll probably start salivating at the mouth. Like, oh, I got like lean you. Weed, that's my favorite thing. The whole world. Yeah, I got so much freaking weed already. How do I... What's the... Button. Okay. No, I wanted to combine it. Whatever. Alright. How many of you guys in the chat have ever played this game? Yes or no? Alright, guys. Here's the big question. Here's the real question. Wait, oh yeah, uh, for some reason, here's a weird easter egg. For some reason, if you kill this crow, he drops a grenade. I don't know why this crow was carrying a grenade. I, I don't understand. Also, what a nice welcoming sign, dude. I don't know. I don't know why that crow was packing explosives. All right, chat, here's a real question. Do we kill or spare the dog? First person, tell me. First person, kill or spare him. It's up to chat. It's not up to me. Kill or spare the, the puppy. Spare? All right. You're lucky you typed fast. If Epic Man was here, that dog would be dead. I'll live to see another day. Now we don't... See, now we don't have to fight Sans at the end, so we're good. Also... I, when I first played this game, I fell for these trip wires and I just got exploded. There's also a bear trap in the middle too, so they're just like coming at you at all ends. Would you call me? Boy. Leon is also my favorite male Resident Evil character. I know a lot of people like Chris and a lot of people like, is there, who else? Carlo? Is there anybody that likes Carlos? Uh, Steve. Steve sucks too. Pretty much Leon and Chris, the only two cool male characters. The rest, like, Steve, who gives a shit? Billy? Uh, who likes Billy? Billy's a freaking ex convict. Um, but my favorite character in the whole series is Ada. Hey, what's up, Retro Ruler? Welcome to Month of Horror. Save the animals, kill the people. The hell kind of. Oh, also, there's, like, this actually scared me. Like, when I first played this game when I was, like, 11 or 12 years old, this next thing scared me more than any of the guys trying to kill me. Like, this, want to see what gave me nightmares? This is what gave me nightmares. I was walking on in here. I was like, okay, what's going on? Blah, 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 blah. And I turn, and there's a freaking lady that's face impaled with the pitchfork. And that was, like, the most gruesome shit I ever saw. Hunk's pretty cool, actually. 
Does anybody know what hunk stands for? Fake Resident Evil fans? Stands for human unit never killed. Is he coming or what's going on here? Guess there's no sex discrimination here. <laughs> like, come on. This game is dumb. It's so dumb that I love it. It's so cheesy. That's what he's going to say. Then it's like, guess there's no sex discrimination here. <laughs> it's like, yeah, cue the fucking laugh track. <laughs> Why is that so loud? <laughs> Better find her fast. I gotta freaking go. For some reason, my laugh track is now playing through my mic, so it's really loud. I don't know why it's so loud. I, I, I'll have to fix that later. Here we kill men and women equally. And kids. Alright. What's up, boy? Oh, how do I get him? I'm just knifing him in the face. I'm trying to save my bullets. Oh my gosh, dude. You even sound like a human. You sound like a dog barking. Also, I think there's like an Easter egg. You can see like villagers go like warn the other villagers if you look up here quick enough. Yeah, up there. See? You can't kill them. No matter how try hard you try, they just run. Just a little set piece. Yeah, nice try, boy. Peekaboo. Dumbass, I gotcha. No, no! Whoa, 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 <laughs> Could I get the, the game? Really? Even even higher? Okay. I, I turned it up last time and you guys said it was good, but I guess. I don't know. That's fine. Oh, what's going on with my audio? While I'm here, see if I can fix this here. Settings? Output. Sound mode. Wait a second. Hold up. Let me just cry it right Something weird's going on, Chad. Hold up, let me try something else. Alright. Uh. I don't know why it's. I don't know why it's playing through both. Let me fix something. Sorry, my audio settings are weird. Right, hello, hello. Let's let's try this now. Sorry, my shit was muted. Okay, I fixed it. I was at no. I was just I was I was using that as a sound test. Um, it's hard to explain unless you also stream. But my my sound effects were coming through my mic setup. Instead of my computer speakers where I have the volume lower. Yeah, I wanted the sound effects lower. Now everything should be a little louder and better balanced. Sorry. Te it's weird. It's weird because I just streamed from PlayStation. I haven't streamed on PlayStation in a while, so all the settings were kind of like a little off. But everything should be good now. I hope. Bad question, Hunnigan. Leon, how you holding up? Bad question, Hunnigan. Sorry to hear that. I'm sending you a playing manual. Hope you find it useful. I'll take a look at it. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. We don't need a... I feel like Birdly. We don't need a manual. I'm a real gamer. Um, but uh, is, is it weird that like when I tried to convince my family to let me play this game, the thing that they were the most concerned about was the swearing? Is that weird? I it feel like that was just really weird. They didn't give a shit about the violence and murder and death. It was just like, does he say too many swears? Yeah. That's literally, that's what I remember the most. Ah, it's Month of Horror. Be 
mierda. No, I don't even swear that much. Okay, I swear just the right amount for what I have to experience. You, you, you play these cursed things where Mario's fat and like you can't move him right and stuff, and he's like getting sucked under the ground, and you try to keep your composure. All right. Mierda. Dang, dude, that's I didn't. They really uh, did not do that guy justice. They really smoked him like a log. Look at them. They're just going about their day, and this guy's burning in the. On days like today, kids like you should be burning in hell. <laughs> Alright, well, we got Farmer Jim and his friends uh, going up here. Hey, Aka! What in? Yeah, yeah, that's the problem. It's fine. Look, I think. Hey, if I know anything about, uh, you know, how to talk to people and how to be social, it's that there's nothing, if, 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 any, if Undertale taught me anything, it's that nothing cannot be solved with, uh, without words, or with words, you know? You can solve anything with words. So we don't need weapons, all right? In fact, we're gonna just, like, not even equip this. Just gonna walk up to him, and we're just gonna have a nice, friendly chat, all right? Be like, hey, uh, I'm looking for the president's daughter. You guys seem like a nice, respectable group of people. You know, how are you doing? Name's Leon, uh, from America. You know, hey ma'am, you doing okay? Nice to see you, how are you doing? Hey, I didn't mean to, okay. Never mind, never, jeez! Okay, I'm out of here, bro. Peace. Damn, going to the house. <laughs> you talking about task manager? Who the hell are these people? <laughs> That's what I'd say. I'd be like, who the hell? Son of a... <laughs> Dang, Leon's saying more swears than me. You guys are yelling at me for swearing. This guy's saying F-bomb this every 10 seconds. All right, well, we got to hurry up because these people are really upset. This is like when there's one PS5 left in Best Buy electronics department. How'd this chicken get in here? How'd you get in here, buddy? He's pissed. Sometimes chat doesn't like... Hey, I don't like to swear that much either because sometimes, you know, some people don't like it. And honestly, I don't like to just rely on swearing all the time. It, it, I like to be a little more creative with my vocabulary when I'm talking to streams. Like, no, then. A well-placed. Oh, my gosh, guys, look. It's Altair Ibn La'ahad. All right, hold up. I don't want them getting in through the window, so. Ah! Gee, Louis, bro. Get out of here, old man. Bro, get the heck. I'll never forget. Dude, come on. What the, I'm shooting. How many bullets can this guy take? Okay, yeah, we're just this bad. This is a bad day. Can I get the hell out of here, bro? There's a bunch of guys in this house. <laughs> Gee Louise, man. The hell's going on around here? Freak out of here. My gosh, I was like five. He called me. Oh, what? He called me Bendejo. My friend used to have a dog named Pendejo, and it was a big, fat, crazy-ass, um, bulldog. And then they had to give him away because he kept biting kids. <laughs> True story. Jeez. There's no window. Whoa, whoa. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Whoa, he's dodging, bro. How am I supposed to get out of here? Jeez, can I get another gun? <laughs> I don't want to be in the room with this guy. <laughs> get a sexual predator. Pendejo. Well, he was biting kids. He would literally see a kid and be like, <laughs> just bite him in the face. They didn't put him down. I could see if they shot him. But they just like gave him to somebody else who didn't have kids. Bro, get me out of this place. Yeah, I'm out. Does somebody open that? Get the f out of here, dude. Can you open the door a little faster, buddy? Jimmy! Get the fuck out of my house. <laughs> What is this, dude? Trick or treat? Dude, it looks like trick or treat came early, chat. I don't got any candy. None of you wearing costumes. Get the fuck out of my house. Fuck's sake, man. It's the beginning of the game. Just starting the damn thing. Can I get a smoke break? 
I got egg my house? That's the least of my problems. What's up, cow? Give me a yellow weed, bro. Jeez, this is a bad just about the guy I wanna fuck with. Hell I'll see you people. Hey, steady! What's in here? There's nothing in this box, dude! Where are they? I hear the chainsaw. I don't see the chainsaw. Why, why'd the chicken scare you? What? The chicken wasn't doing nothing wrong. I'm not seeing anybody. Where'd everybody go? Bingo. Oh, 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 hey, hey guys. Hey, buddy. Oh, I didn't know why I didn't reload. Please. I'm trying to kick. It looked like a child. <laughs> what? I ain't never seen a chicken that looked like a child in my life. Cursed child. Whoa, dude! Bro, I didn't swear what the fuck? Bro, where did he come from? Oh my gosh. He was right outside the damn door. <laughs> oh my, where did he, dude, he like teleported. Was he Sans? Boo, hey buddy. The fuck? Dude. What? He was not there. Somebody pulled the clip up. Somebody rolled back the clip, bro. He was not right there. I went out there to this gaster blaster. What is it, Diga Nino? I just time I ain't messing with these guys, dude. Last time they were tricking me. This time I'm tricking them. Yeah, this is what happens when you try to be nice. In this world, it's kill or be killed. Bitches. Hey, ma'am, wanna play catch? Don't miss. Look at Leon's a Chad, dude. He's just walking. Okay, never mind. Hold up. Sigma male. Get out of here. Alright, I'm ready this time. Bad time? No! <laughs> no okay, hold up. I gotta change. I gotta turn to bad time alerts on now. Well, now bad time alerts are on. So all follows, donations, and subs are bad time of fight. Even when I play Resident Evil, I can't escape this garbage. Alright, hold up. Retro Dark, I don't know if you're still here. I know you're talking about mommy, dummies, or whatever. But if you're still here, do you consider Resident Evil 4 to be retro? Because it is like 15 years old, or is that not old enough to be retro? I'm just curious, it's a legitimate question. Do you consider a game like this that was on the GameCube and PS2 to be retro, or is this... Because it's like the same era as like Halo and everything. I just was wondering if people consider Resident Evil 4 to be retro. Alright, back up from the door. Alright, you guys want to play this game? That's fine, dude. I, you know, you guys don't leave me much room. I try to be a nice guy, and you bring the devil out of me. This was on GameCube originally. It's on the Wii. They, they ported it to the Wii because of the motion controls, but it was originally a GameCube game. That was the first platform it ever came to. Um, yeah, it was GameCube, PS2, and then the Wii. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Somebody I work with is going as Bubba from Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Who is that? Is that the guy that does the chainsawing? They were talking about it, and I didn't know. Like, I haven't seen that movie in a long time. I don't remember any character named Bubba. Bubba, that's that's the killer. The killer's Bubba. I didn't want to. I didn't want to act like I didn't know what I was talking about, so I didn't ask. But I decided I'd ask you guys, because I don't really care what you guys think of me. You've already seen me at my worst, anyways. Can I open up the box? Because there's gonna inevitably be a guy here. Okay. Maybe not. I thought there was like a bunch of guys right behind me, but I guess we're safe. Okay, yeah, we're gonna have a big party over here. I got you. Check this. Check this out. Come on, bust that window. Bust that window. Come on. Come on. 
This is like, literally, I've already made this joke, but I'm going to make it one more time. This is literally like when I do a morning shift at my job. I'm not even lying. You guys think I'm trying to be funny. I'm really not even trying to be funny. Um, this is like when I work a morning shift at my job, and this is five minutes before we unlock the doors. These are literally customers. I'm not even lying. Like, we, we open at 10 a.m., and these will be the people face pressed up against the glass, pounded. Oh, you guys go pay you Because you, you need, like, food at, like, 10 a.m. on the dot. Literally, that's the customers. I wish I could do this. Come on, open the window. Are there guys behind me? Yeah, there's a guy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on, buddy. I'm just trying to, I was trying to do a firebomb. Come on, dickhead. Yes, get on. Get out of town. How many bullets does it take? I'm breaking the window myself. How about a little fire, scarecrow? Boom, burn. That's what I thought, dummy. That's what I thought, punk, eh, punkinello. Now where the hell is my pistoli? Hey. I shouldn't go in here because they're just gonna pin me in, but there's like stuff I wanna get in here. I'm gonna try to be in and be out. See, how could I how could I pass up shotgun shells? Gee, come on, I hate being locked away with this guy. Come on, back up, back the frick up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, ma'am. It's your friendly neighborhood, Leon Scott Kennedy. Don't reload now, don't reload now. Go, 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 go. Jeez, bro. See how this game is like, in, it's not like scary, but it's like intense. Get your adrenaline. I feel all tense, dude. I need to, why's he got a bag on his head, dude? When, when I first played this game, uh, my stepbrother and the neighbor kid, we always called him Jason. Even though Jason wears a hockey mask, we still called him Jason. You get the fuck out of the That was so close to death, I'm running before he gets up. I'm gonna kill you? Dang, that's not very polite, you know? It's not very nice to say. Whoa, dude, where, come on, where are these guys coming from? Come on, we got John Tom Sawyer. Didn't I just kill you a screen ago? I thought that was the door. We did it. Here, this this is this is the dumbest thing, but it's how they start the game. Really intense scene, and listen to what he says. And people say that this game's not goofy. Where's everyone going? Bingo? It's such an inappropriate time for that. It's so... He's like, where's everyone going, bingo? Oh my gosh, dude. I love it, though. I See, I love that. But I also love it in 5 and 6. And people are like, 5 and 6 aren't scary. They're too goofy. This game is goofy, too, bro. This shit's full of goofs. Where's everyone going, bingo? Like, dude, they almost killed us. Not, like, and this is the thing. Who's he making that joke for? It's just him. He's just saying it for himself. You know what I mean? There's like too much discrepancies here. See, I love that this game is goofy. That that's the charm of it to me. That's what makes it charming and and fun. But people are like, five and six are stupid. But they they're good. I like they're all good. You tell jokes to the chickens. <laughs> Yeah, Leon's imaginary friend. He just has like really bad uh, schizophrenia. All right, I'm just wandering around because I'm looking to see if there's any ammunition that I missed. Okay, there. See? Could you imagine if I would have missed that? Now we can move on with our lives.
I don't know, I think Leon's pretty cool. He's a suave, joke-cracking man. With a plan. He's trying to make himself laugh, I guess, yeah. I guess I'm guilty of that, too. Half the jokes I say are just to make me laugh. If you guys can't tell. This is a pretty good start to Month of Horror, don't you guys agree? And don't worry, I know you guys love Mario and Zelda. We're going to be doing that, too. We got Mario and Zelda this month as well. I'm just sprinkling some horror games. We're not doing a bunch. There's a couple here and there. Guess I should probably save. I probably have a bunch of old save files. Oh yeah. Oh, do I have a bunch? Oh my gosh. This one will be number 13 since that's a spooky boogie number. It's a, it's a milky finisher tradition. You guys know me. I love my traditions. I like doing this. It's only once a year. Mario and Zelda will happen all the time. Resident Evil 4 reminds you of Resident Evil 8. That's on purpose. Um, Resident Evil 8 is called Resident Evil Village. Uh, and it, it was supposed to, like, reinvoke the feeling of Resident Evil 4 by being in, like, a European, have a European setting and stuff like that. I haven't played it yet, though, because I'm waiting to play it on a PlayStation 5. Whoa! I missed him. He's still running. He's like freaking ready Randy over here. This is where you play a Pona song and the cow gives you milk. Whoa! Farmer Dan over here. Okay. The cow's like, stop you, my buddy. Who's gonna feed me now? You're on your own, bud. Everyone's wearing cheesy Halloween costumes. If I knew how to hack games, I would make my own, but I have no idea how to. And as much as I actually really like Resident Evil 7 and 8, I, I don't really like the first-person perspective. I like this. I like the behind-the-shoulder. Also, look at this, dude. All <laughs> these bodies. Pile of bodies just chopped up in the wagon. What a great place. Well, the Zelda games, which are my favorite horse? What kind of whack-ass question is it? Um, <laughs> I guess Epona. Because, like, I don't even use the horses in, like, any other Zelda game. I mean, I guess Breath of the Wild, but, like, you can use any horse. I don't ever really use Epona in Majora's Mask. I don't ever really use Epona in Twilight Princess because I just use Midna to teleport everywhere. There is no horse in Skyward Sword. There is no horse in Wind Waker. So I guess, by default, Ocarina of Time. The closest Zelda ever got to a horror game was the bottom of the well in Shadow Temple. The Shadow Temple is legitimately scarier than, like, most horror games that came out on the N64. There weren't many. But the Shadow Temple, especially before they centered it, because they centered it in the 3DS remake. Um, but in the original, there's, like, blood splattered all over the walls and a lot more, like, demonic imagery and stuff. Nah, the eels... Well, okay... The Shadow Temple is, like, objectively scarier because it's more horror-themed. I am personally more scared of the eels because that's a personal phobia. I understand that not everybody has a fear of the bottom... Whoa! Uh, fear of the bottom of the ocean like me. Like, I have a fear of e uh, eels and, like, the bottom of dark water. And that's a specific thing to me. Like, that triggers my phobia more than, like, skeletons and murder of blood. You know what I mean? So, yeah, the, the, eels, the eels scare me more, but I don't think that they're, like factually scarier because there's a lot of people that don't care especially like early like the eel in mario 64 was scary the eels in majora's mask was scary some about like the low resolution low poly dead-eyed look of some of those sea creatures is almost scarier than like photorealistic graphics you thought the bullets were credit cards dude leon's making bank he just keeps picking up credit card information No, 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 it's okay. I'm gonna head out. Thanks for chatting with me. You're not scared of any horror games? Have you? Oh, you you were here last year for my PT stream. I do one PT stream every uh, every year, so. Obviously, we're gonna do it this year, too. 
Ay, está. Here's another goofy part. This game is very gritty and realistic. Here comes a big rock! <laughs> Run from- Here comes Indiana Jones! Oh shit, oh what? I didn't- I thought it was gonna be the triangle. I didn't know it was gonna be the triggers. I didn't know it was gonna make me do the triggers at the end. Wait, that's Jurassic Park? What's Indiana Jones then? What's Indiana Jones then? Jojo! I don't know. I, uh. How does that one go? No, I thought Jurassic Park was the. Isn't that, is that what I did? <laughs> I don't even know what I did anymore. There you go. Buddy. Round two. This time I'm ready. <laughs> so dumb. You're trying to pick me up! <laughs> Alright. Um. Yeah, I played Wario World for GameCube. I actually thought that was an awesome game. Super underrated. I missed the GameCube era of Nintendo because that's when, like, Nintendo was very, like, experimental. I'm not even gonna get those. Um, Nintendo was very experimental. Like, you had games like Luigi's Mansion, Mario Sunshine, and say what you will about Mario Sunshine, I'm not the hugest fan. I do love the game. I don't think it's, like, the best Mario. But, like, it was super, like, out there and unique and had voice acting and Shadow Mario and stuff like that. So, uh, Nintendo was a lot more creative with stuff. Like, they were willing to do more weird stuff. And Wario World was one of them. I own it. No, I own a physical copy. I got it upstairs. I can show you next stream. I don't want to run all the way up six flights of stairs to go grab it, but... Um, oh, great. These are the Dynamite Dan guys. Uh, but yeah, I own a copy in great condition. I would never sell it, though. I like how this guy's getting shot and, like, nobody, like, is alerted. How many bullets does it take to get to the Tootsie Roll Center? Tootsie Pop. Y'all, what's up, Velvet Mushrooms? Welcome to Milky Finisher's Month of Horror. We're playing RE4. Dude, this game's nutty like the professor. Also, look at this big spider. I hate it. Look at it. Ugh. Ugh, I hate it. Uh, who's blowing shit up? I'm killing his ass with a knife. Get out of here. Whoa, hello? Is it somebody's birthday? We got a fucking candle? <laughs> Get away from trying to talk to the spider, douchebag. Run! Thanks for the sub. Great. This is bad alert. <laughs> this, is a, this is not the right day. <laughs> Fucking hate this alert. <laughs> we are monsters. The <laughs> awful this guy. I forgot that Charlations made me put on the meme alerts. Well, hey, hopefully you enjoy your sub. Thank you, Myth, for the gifted sub. I hope that you enjoy your stay. My name is Zach. We play a lot of Zelda and, and Mario and stuff, but we do a special thing every October called Month of Horror where we play a couple spooky games as well. Um, so thanks and enjoy your sub. Enjoy those cute, awesome emotes made by the really talented chat members. Uh, forgive my alerts. Our follow donation and all those alerts are all goofed up because I have bad alerts on. I gotta change it too because, um, I gotta make new meme alerts so they're not always the same. It's been the same Roblox Sans Welcome to the Underground song for like three years straight. Also, what, where's my health? What the heck happened? I like blink and like all my health is gone now. How was the fall? How do I combine? There we go. 
That didn't do nothing, dude. I gotta smoke two rounds of herb. I just wanted to kill this spider, dude. Yeah, I got him. He squished up. <laughs> I fucking hate my streets. <laughs> Thanks for the follow. <laughs> Thanks for the follow. <laughs> what a what a way to break this game's immersion. This game is great immersion. <laughs> got fucking sands and papyrus. We just finished Delta Root. I can never escape. How many years has it been? I can never escape. No, it'll blow up! Dude, I'm so sick of this explosives, dude. Was this Keezy's village? I didn't know it would do that. <laughs> what up, buddy? Hey, you better drop that candlestick. Jack be nimble, Jack be quick. Get smoke, nerd. That's what I'm talking about. Dude, how many people? Come on, I'm running, run. Get away from me! Yes, I ex How did he take damage, but I didn't? I don't care, that's fine. Oh my gosh. What type of games do you like, Velvet? What's some of your favorite games while we try to barely survive? Spooky ones? Well, you're gonna like this month. I waited until the second half of October to start scary games because I just didn't have that many to pick from. Oh no. No! No! Followed immediately by a Spamton reference. Now's your chance to be a big shot. Spooky month. Some oh, why is there so many trip wires? Someone's knocking on the door. Spooky and cutesy. No, Charlations. This was actually the first Resident Evil that stopped that trend. Um, the originals, 1, 2, 3, and Code Veronica, uh, you had to have ink ribbons in order to save. You needed to... Um, so you only had a limited amount of saves. This was actually the first mainline Resident Evil that took that away. And uh, for people like me, I think that's for the better because I have like a saving addiction. I never like to lose progress. So I always like to save immediately. And the other old school games stressed me the hell out. You know what? I could only save like four times till the end of the game. I was like, ah, I don't know, man. You know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of Majora's Mask when uh, Pamela's dad comes out. You know, and then he's like, rrr, rrr, and you play the song of healing. You know? That's what it reminds me of. Yeah, they, uh, they remade two and three if you play on easy or normal, that doesn't happen. But if you play on hard or professional or whatever, it's called veteran. I don't know what the, whatever the higher difficulty. Then they do that. They don't do that on the uh, on the on the normal one. All right, let's see what's in the closet. What's in the cupboard? <laughs> ah! <laughs> it was puppet in the closet. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Little rub, don't you think? <laughs> You're not like them. No. <laughs> shit, 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 come, shit comes out of lurking to do the double pop team epic middle finger. <laughs> Dude, I didn't know Puppet was in this game too. Five Nights at Leon's. Oh shit, it's the big cheese, dude. <laughs> Two Resident Evil 4. <laughs> that's Freddy, uh, that's the purple guy, too. There he is. He's a little less purple than I remember. Damn, dude. Freaking nuts. We just save, let's save again. 
If this was Resident Evil 1, we would have used up all the saves for the rest of the playthrough. <laughs> Dear month of horror. Feeble human. Feeble human. give you our power. Our power is heroin. <laughs> Yeah, I could try. I don't know if this game actually does. I don't know if they started doing that till the newer ones. I could try. I don't know if a lot of GameCube and PS2 games didn't have subtitles, but I could try. He just impregnated Leon. Have you guys ever gotten pregnant in the neck before? I can't do it now, can I? Hey, wake up. No, I can't. Crawl out of one hole and into another. You want to tell me what's going on here? Americano, see? Now what brings a bloke like you to this part of the world? Bloke? Hey, easy. Easy. Whoever you are. I like Lewis. Name's Liam. He's funny. Came here looking for this girl. Seen her? What, are you supposed to be a cop or something? Nah, you don't look the type. Maybe. Leon in this game also kind of looks like the protagonist from Silent Hill 2. A little bit. It's too good for a guess. Want to start explaining? Psychic powers. Psychic powers. Nah, I'm just kidding with you, amigo. I overheard one of the villagers talking. Here comes the executioner. And who might you be? Me llamo Luis Serra. I used to be a cop in Madrid. Now I'm just a good-for-nothing guy who happens to be quite a ladies' man. Why'd you quit? <laughs> it's a bug, dude. You I hate the, the cucaracha at the top. Nobody really appreciates you enough for it. Being a hero isn't what it's The worst part is, from this point on, Leon never wears his jacket again. If you guys liked watching Leon uh, wear his awesome jacket, well, too bad. He just, he never wears it the rest of the game. It's very so depressing. I managed to get myself involved with the incident in Raccoon City. Raccoon City. first day in the force. That is the incident with the viral outbreak, right? I think I might have seen a sample of the virus in the lab at the... He doesn't go shirtless. I don't think I don't think Leon ever goes shirtless. Chris does, but Leon's better than Chris. So. Oh wait, I gotta do something here. Hold up. Easy. Easy. Whoa, 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 whoa! He <laughs> got freaking. Yeah, look, and he just starts running. Wow, really cool. Lewis like, like Zoic Scuba, I'm out of here. And Leon's like, what? Like, come on, this game's got goofy ass shit, dude. Leon. Sorry, I couldn't if I was Leon, I'd be like, get the army, get the, okay. you know, CIA, Navy SEALs, Marines, get them here now, bro. And says, like, no, I got it. Just by myself. I'm like, send every drone strike towards the whole freaking village. passage in the village it leads there. I'm heading back to the village. Yeah, and then here comes Sub Zero. Over here, stranger. I was like, what? I was like, excuse me? Who are you? Crackhead? Yeah, it's like, you wanna some crack rocks it's like dude I got enough to worry about right hey kid I got that amiibo you wanted who's this got something that might interest you Yeah. What are you buying? Uh, we sh sure, buddy. Can I can't even fit this shit in here. I can't. 
Thank you. Got what I needed. Out of my way, bitch. <laughs> Genocide route. All right. <laughs> now that this crisis has been averted, let's continue Leon's adventure. <laughs> All right, we're, we're continuing. <laughs> Yo, what up, DJ? I love Resident Evil. Uh, what are your opinions on the rumored Resident Evil 4 uh, remake? Are you excited? You don't think this game needs a remake? You think uh, you're worried they're gonna ruin it? Excited that they might do something cool? It's up to you. Aw, oh, snap. We got the whole gang now. But, uh, yeah. In terms of, like, AAA single-player games, this game is ridiculous. It's got, like, five-plus chapters worth of content, multiple cutscenes, post-game modes, multiple playable characters... Man, I'm sick of all these dynamite guys. Dynamite! A gold the amiibo. See, this might be a hot take, and like I, I consider myself a pretty big Resident Evil fan. I love this series. Uh, not everybody agrees with me, but I actually like RE2 remake more than the original. Yes, I know that it cut some stuff out. Um. But to me, like, I don't know. Uh, I love the behind the shoulder. I love the re-envisioned. I think they did it justice. Um, I'll still go back and play the original every now and then, but I think RE2 Remake is is my favorite version of that story and that, you know, exploring the police station and William Birkin and all that trash. Why is there so many men? I know, right? Like, you have all these characters. They even brought back Hunk and Wesker, but they didn't, like, make Lewis playable. It's very strange. Because they already had animations for Lewis to, like, shoot guns and stuff with these two twins. Um, in this, because, like, when you're defending the house with Lewis. So, I, it's very weird that they never... Uh... Even mercenaries one. I think, uh, I think Charlation is talking about, like, how the originals have the tank controls. Like, RE1, RE2, RE3, the classics, like, have the tank controls, which were controversial. Like, it's easy for me because I grew up with that. I'm gonna eat this chicken egg, by the way. But I do agree it's probably hard for new players who have never played the series before to get into that. That's why I'm glad that when they ported RE1 Remake, they took away the tank controls or they made it a toggleable thing. I personally prefer to play the games without tank controls, but I understand that for nostalgia purposes, uh, some people like them. That guy just killed his own men. How many times do I gotta shoot him, dude? Stop lighting up the dynamite. Dude, I look seven bullets in his cranium. No, I think RE4's controls are perfect. Yeah, you know, I was talking about, like, the old-school, like, RE1, like, tank control movement. No, this, uh, this, I think this is fine. They, don't, no, 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 don't, don't worry about the follow alerts, chat. Chat made me do meme alerts because if, if you watch, you know, channel points, chat spent a lot of channel points and they made all my alerts stupid. Don't, don't judge me. All right. Chat, blame chat. Blame chat. Blame your fellow, that's not me. That's not, that's your fellow viewers that made that shit happen. <laughs> I didn't do it. Who's this guy just staring at me, dude? Who's this peeping Tom? It's like the neighbor guy that like just watches me every time I let my dog out. He's just standing out there like licking his lips in the third floor window. I'm like, hey, dude, watch it, dude. How about you watch that, little bastard? 
Um, I had to take away Big Splat because Twitch sucks, and uh, even though YouTube is working again, um, Discord won't connect to Twitch, and the third party that I had to play sounds and stuff won't work. People were doing the Big Splat, and it wasn't working. Like, it wasn't playing the audio, so I just have to wait until Twitch fixes it. I don't know. I'm happy that they fixed the YouTube thing, but I'm still waiting them for I'm waiting on them to fix their other thing. So Most of the curses are in like Spanish, dude. Whoa, more guys. I got a present for you, bud. Play catch. Yeah. Also my there we go. Pro mode OG handgun only. Is that even possible? You did it, actually? I've beaten this game on professional before, but I've never done just the handgun. I don't even know how some of the bosses. I can see getting through, but like, the bosses, dude? Is that even possible? How do you fight, like, Salazar? My gosh. Should I chill on my sailor swords? No, 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 no! No, no, you can swear as much as you want. I just said that as the streamer, I try to not swear too, too much. I still say crazy words all the time. But I, I don't want every single thing I say to be like the F-bomb. I just want to be a little bit more creative in, in how I express my anger. Um, no, I, I, I say all kinds of stuff, but I don't, I just don't, like, to, I don't like to spam it, you know? I don't, like, pff, I don't like people coming to my stream and that's all they hear every second for me. Chad, I don't care. People get used to that. People will chat to hold everything. I don't care. Whatever you guys say. 90 minutes to beat them? Dude, was that even fun? I feel like that would just make me sad. These guys got the same taste in beanies. I kicked them and it didn't work. Now it worked. I gotta find the other piece of the Master Emerald. <laughs> So many people, dude. What's the population of this town? No, 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 no. Dude, there's so many. Just working class citizens. It doesn't help that I don't remember where the other half is. What about the part where there's like the two L gigant? There we go, I found it. The two. What the heck, dude? He's got a nut shot with an axe. Um, the two L gigantes. Well, I guess one of them you can just. Put through the floorboards. Uh, combine with this. Smoke it up. Keep treasures. Connect. Beautimus. Whoa, 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 Chill, 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 chill. Chill, chill, chill! Chill. This is the wrong way to do a vasectomy. Poor Leon, he'll never have kids again. Why was that so stressful? I'm running out of ammo. Eh, I got days no mind. I'm crying. I'm crying for nothing, Chet. What else is new? Okay, the reason why I said ammo, I don't actually pronounce that. I know it's called ammo. There's actually a funny story behind that. So, again, this also, it's funny that you bring that up because that also has to do with the neighbor kid I was talking about earlier in the stream. So, me, my stepbrother, me and my stepbrother, when we were young, I'm talking like 11, 12 years old, we used to hang out with this neighbor kid. And he was kind of like a little bitch, you know? He was like, he was the same age as us, but he was way less mature. Like, he would always cry. Like, I, I'm not even trying to roast this guy, but like, he was the same age as us. So, like, 11, 12, but he was so, like, weirdly attached to his dad that like anytime his dad would like go to the bathroom to take a piss he'd have to go in the bathroom with his dad because he was scared of like not being around his dad and i could see that when you're like four but like 11 do his double digits still watching his dad piss i was trying to figure out what's going on with that it was really weird that's a, that's, that's, i digress so there's a part he would always be a crybaby. um 
like, he would always be a crybaby, and, like, we'd always play it. If, if we ever played a little rough, and we're all roughing with each other, and if you bumped into him, he'd be like, eh, and he always calls dad. Always his dad. Dad, 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 every day. So, I'll never forget, <laughs> this was, it was, like, the most in, it was, like, the most non-aggressive thing ever. My stepbrother and I were walking, we were playing in the yard, and then he comes out of his house all mad. He's got a big Nerf gun, okay? big huge nerf gun and he pointed at my stepbrother's head and just fires and the nerf rocket just goes pff, right past my stepbrother and all my stepbrother did is he just he walked and he picked up the rocket like the nerf rocket he picked up the rocket and then the kid like burst into tears and he's like my dad said no taking my ammo and then he ran in and then his dad came out he was like why are you taking my son's ammo and you're like what i was like why are you guys pronouncing it like that first off so then we went back, we're like, we're not playing outside today, we're just gonna play inside, play some Resident Evil 4. So we just played it, and I was I could not believe that. True story! True ass story! He also broke one of my stepbrother's, like, GameCube games, like, broke the disc, and he never paid for it. He always, like, he got my stepmom to, like, contact, he's like, hey, is your son gonna pay for my son's broken game? And he never did. He never paid for jack shit. But I'll never forget that. Like, all he did was shoot the rocket, not even aggressively. My stepbrother just picked it up, and he burst into tears, like, My dad said no taking my ammo. And then he just comes out, I was like, Why are you taking his ammo? And I was like, What? I was like, What are we living? Like, an episode of The Simpsons? I was like, There's so many things here out of my brain, can't even, like... I just went inside, and then they were like, Uh, why is the neighbor kid crying? What did you guys do? We explained it to my dad and stepmom, and they were like, What the hell's wrong with him? Like, yeah, that's why we don't hang out with him anymore. That was a dumbass. Dumbass. So, still to that day, though, I guess the joke's on me because to this day, I always say Amo as a joke. I'll always, like, I always say Amo because of that moment. That moment, like, burned into my brain. What is he doing, bro? Doing the stinky, like? Um, that moment, like, burned itself into my memory banks. What's up, Lola? I always want to call you Lola Pop, but that's the name of the clown girl from ARMS. How do you pronounce her name? Lollipop. I always just call you Lollipop, like the like the clown. <gasps> dude, I just dodged that axe with my bullet. No, I'm gonna do, do it again. Yeah, dude, Leon's sick. He's a sharpshooter. Rudeness, tuneness, cowboy. Come on, get off me, man. How many axes does this guy have in his pocket? There's like seven axes. <laughs> it's enough. Quit getting up. Lolfomp? Is that real? Just call you Hop. I'll just call you Hop. <laughs> Let me show you my axes, kiddo. <laughs> this is Gaster Axis. That's so stupid. Yeah, what? I just imagined. I just imagined Leon picks up one of the axes off the floor. It's like, my dad said, don't take my axe. Oh. He cries and tells Sadler. Why is the scary music still playing? I thought I killed them all. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah, dude. That's cool, man. That's awesome. I love when they do that one. Nothing a little weed and chicken eggs can't solve. Peace out. Play catch, son. Please kill him. I wasted that, dude. I wasted it. I wasted it. Stop. Crying out loud. No! No, 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 no! He's gonna get me. Where are you, turd? Where are you at? I'm playing whack-a-mole. Yeah, I get him. Gosh. He still moves. Who's moving? You guys are freaking me out. Who's still moving? Who's this? Johnny Pitchfork? Come on, there he is. There's a guy attached on the other side of the door. Come on, bid. Come on. A little more to the right. Oh, come on, dude. I, I'm not wasting any more of my freaking ammunition on this guy. The one dude whose head blew up. Well, they said that the body still, like, reacts for a few seconds after the head's detached. 
They said in the medieval days when they would decapitate people that like their bodies would twitch for at least 10 seconds. So I mean, it's plausible. Somebody did that and then they were mad that I didn't ban myself. But I was like, what did you want me to do? Somebody used Bites the Dust on me before and then they got like, I think it was Retro Dark. He's like, I use it on you. Like, what do you want me to do? What? How do you how do you realistically expect that to work? Come on, man! I thought I triggered them all. What is this camera angle? I was like, in your mind, what do you want to happen when you ban the streamer? I just go offline for ten minutes? That doesn't make any sense. Psst. Nice, nice aim, dude. Ten minute be right back. I originally I wanted. I wanted either Leon or Dante from Devil May Cry and Smash, always, but I'm happy with the characters. I'm happy with Smash Bros. I'm not complaining about anything. We already got more characters than I ever dreamed of. I use so much bullets on these farmers. Uh, I guess not. I guess I keep picking them up at the same rate. I do have to smoke more herb, though. What are you guys talking about? Reproduction games. I don't know what the heck kind of weird stuff you guys play in your free time playing reproduction games. <laughs> what the heck is that, dude? What? It's a little sus if you ask me. I remember when I thought that this was like the best graphical game in the world. Now looking at this water, I'm like, bro, what the heck? What is this? That's almost how most Americans get their sex ed. I was going to say something, but I'm not. <laughs> now I'm going to stay locked in the Zach Lolly vault. <laughs> Come on, dude, quit screaming. There's indoor voices. What does that mean, a Blockbuster Pro? Like, this, the rental store? Blockbuster? No, it, it, remind, it reminds me of this one game that I used to play. <laughs> it was, like, I guess that would be a reproductive game. But, I don't really know how it would hold up. Also, let's catch some fish, bro. No, the game, yeah, the game age. I'm not, I'm not shitting on the game because the water texture look goofy. Let's get this big mouth Billy Bass here. Yeah. Can I even, like, fit it in? What's that, what's that thing, that song that you were singing? He's like, he's a little song I wrote. Might want to play it, not for not. Don't worry. Right, fit him in the box. Be happy. <laughs> See, I, I can't get him in there cause, just because of this. Or can I? Oh. oh, I can't fit it because of that. There's got to be a way, right? I want to get the fish with me, man. He's chilling in the tackle box. He's my buddy. I don't think I can do this. Wait a second. Yes, I can. I got. It. I got the. I got the solution. I got the solution. Hold up. Let's load this up. There we go. That used the other bullets. There. Now we have room. Well, no, because that gun's still not going to... This isn't going to work. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. It's going to be worth it. I promise. It'll be all worth it when we fit the fish in here. I don't think I can. 
I don't think I, I don't think there's going to be any way to fit this fish in here. Oh, but hold up. The dream's not dead yet. Hold up, hold up. Well, I don't need this, do I? I don't need one bullet. Who cares about one bullet? One bullet my ass. All right. Don't you worry, chat. Dang it. I don't need this weed either. Do I? Yeah, we got him in the box. We did it. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. That was all worth it, wasn't it? No, don't use them. Rotate them. Rotate them. Dude, I don't want them upside down in my box. Get that freaking... No, don't use it. How do I move it? There. There. Perfect. There's a little song I wrote. <laughs> I want to say, not for not... Alright, cool. Now I feel like we're a little less alone in this world. What that fish do? You can eat them. Make sashimi. <laughs> yeah, he's putting the he's just awkwardly putting the big fish in the briefcase. Like, come on, you old slippery devil. Alright. Now don't get sad, chat. The, there's three crows here. I'm going to kill one of them. These two crows, totally fine. Nothing bad. This crow, however, we're going to kill because he was actually a registered sex offender. So don't be sad. We actually did a good thing. Guys, you know how many pictures of baby birds he had on his laptop and you're defending him? No, not around, not in the Milky Finishers. Leon does street justice when it comes, got no, no forgiveness for the wicked. <laughs> how is that bad? What, to be a registered sex offender pedophile? What? We got a sick what? We got a sickos we gotta watch in the stream. Alright, I gotta do a puzzle. Shut up. It's like Delta Rune. <laughs> uh Easy every time. Let's go. Twitch staff would like to have a word with you. <laughs> Wait, what up? It's a video game, it's fiction. Alright? You guys can let all the pedophiles free you want in your free time. But here on the Milky Finisher stream, when I'm playing a game, we're doing things the way I want. And if there's a crow. Who's, who's abusing kids? He's dying. Alright? That's called the joy of video games. You can make your own reality. Baby birds. So what? You think you think if there's a crow out there... Okay, okay. Let me, let me phrase it this way. So there's a crow out there, right? And he's a normal working 9 to 5, you know, providing for his family. But he also has a laptop... Filled with just naked baby birds in a big folder called Do Not Open. And you think that he's just a valuable member of bird society? You're out of your mind. Also, here's gonna there's gonna be an Ada cameo, so quiet. Ada's my favorite. <laughs> Alright, here we go. How did we get here? It's like the loft wings. Never bring up birds in my stream, it's always bad. Never goes good. Is that the dude from uh, System of a Down? The toxicity of our city. Wake up! No, 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 wake up! Choking the life out, Leon, dude. You carry the same blood as us, it seems. Nevertheless, you're an outsider. Just remember, if you become unpleasant to our eyes, you'll face severe consequences. Wow, dude, he just left on a high note there. Same blood. <laughs> Can 
could you imagine? Could you could you imagine? Could you imagine if he did that? He just says, "If you become unpleasant to our eyes, we will not hesitate to kill you." And he just like fucking fart reverb echoes off the hallway, and he just walks out. And Leon's like, "What the hell?" <laughs> Bro, this game is weirder than I remember, dude. I haven't played this game in a few years. It's a lot more weird than my memories. Sir, <laughs> my memories serve me. <laughs> what the heck's going on? That's what happens at bingo nights. Leon, I've been able to get some new info that might help you. Fill me in. Fill me in, Dunnigan. I'm sobbing. <laughs> They're called the Los Illuminati. <laughs> I don't remember nuts. Puppet coming out of the closet. I don't remember the big anyway, cheese I mean, ripping a big cheese. I don't remember any of this. But you're okay, what right? is that cursed ass yeah. emoji? But he could have killed it's like Omega him. Lull of like... And he mentioned something about... Of like, I don't know, like a Roblox character? Whatever that means. Carry the cheese. same blood. Hmm. Interesting. Anyway, there are more important things in solving riddles right the now. The Los Illuminados. You're right. Hurry and find that church, Leon. I need to go to church and cleanse myself of the sins that I've committed. You know, Leon's killed so many people already, dude. He's what, probably killed, what, 40 people? That's a lot of people to kill. 40 have been slain by Leon. That's nuts. Look at this ugly-ass picture. Let's go see Ada. I like Ada. She's my favorite. I just shot a bullet and picked her head. Oh, great. Big cheese again. There she is! Yeah! Yeah! I love her! It's so dumb. It's not funny. Worst stream on Twitch. Alright. <laughs> stupid. <laughs> so stupid. It wasn't funny the first time. It's not gonna be funny the second time. <laughs> what am I doing? Where's the save point? What am I taking? The Chief's note? I don't give a fuck about Chief Keith. Cue the laugh track. Hey, Ada, what do you mean? Ada helped us. Big Cheese was bashing our big brains out, and then Ada provided a distraction. That's good. That's cool. That's more than well, what you guys are doing. Help Leon out. I always talk about how Bomb Chew Girl was my first video game crush, and that's true. But Ada was like my first video game crush when I was like like a teenager or whatever. So there's a big difference there. There's a big mental gap in between the two times. So I probably played Ocarina of Time when I was like seven? I played this game at like four, 13, 14. So those are, those are like the two most iconic video game characters in my head. So, because Bomb Two Girl was the first like video game girl I had a crush on, and then Ada was like the first video game girl I had a crush on when I was like in puberty. Hey, it's a nice kitchen. Hey, I got an egg. Brown chicken egg? This looks a little more white than me. Oh, uh, never mind, never mind. Share some noble squib. Squib? Eat what's in the pan? What is that? Looks disgusting. I don't want that. It looks like, it looks like a, a, to just a tortilla at the bottom of the pan. It's a nice table. Table. Dinner. What's up, bro? Occupado? It's my bathroom now. <laughs> Gotta take a piss. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. I have to take a piss. Be right back. <laughs> Could you imagine this poor old man trying to use the restroom and Leon just kicks out the door and knifes him? Dang, dude. Leon's, Leon used to be my childhood hero. And now he's just kind of like a douchebag. What's 
Squibs? You guys talking about Squib Girls again? Like Splatoon? Oh yeah, captions. Now that like, uh, video settings. What? Do I have to? Okay, I I can actually turn subtitles on, but I'm gonna have to uh, exit really quick. But that's okay because I just saved. So let's return to the main menu. I just saved. So when you gotta go, you gotta go. Thank you. Somebody gets it. Uh, wait. How do I do that? Oh, help and options. Uh, options. Video settings. Um. What? Do you have? What do you have to unlock subtitles? How do I get the option to turn them on? What? What do you mean, yes? I'm playing on PlayStation 4. What? Why are subtitles blurred out? Do you have to have motion blur on to do them? No? What? What's going on here? But why is that even an option? Most games that don't have subtitles just don't say no. They just don't have it as often. You just can't do shit about it. Those TV colors. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry, Charlations. I don't know how to get subtitles on. I gotta lock them in the bonus room, I guess. I'm so confused. That's just weird to me. Okay. What? You can only have English subtitles if you play in another language? Why would they... That's so dumb. Why can't you just have them? They already, they already subtitled the whole game. What the heck? This is the dumbest thing I ever heard. Sorry about that. That is... So dumb. That is so stupid. No oh boy. Oh great dude. Jason's back. Back again. Uh do we have any ammunition? I'm going back in the house, dude. It was bad already. Shit. Can I jump out this window? No. Of course, dude, he's so fast. Uh, shotgun. We tried. Tee -hee. Okay, get out of my life. Come on, with my fish buddy, nobody can stop me. Come on, dude. Oh, I love it when he shoots it out the sky. He was such a badass. I'm so sick of these guys that look like my grandfather. I shouldn't go in here. Damn, there's a lady in here doing stuff. Go. Oh, this is not the time to reload, bro. Get out of my way. <laughs> I'm trying to get some stuff. Find ain't worth it. Wow, red weed. I didn't even need that, dude. Come on. Oh my gosh, dude. That's not what I needed. I can't even pick it up anyways. Can I combine it? Yes, I can. Okay, hold up. Never mind. It was worth it. It was worth it all along. This fish is taking up space now. Try me, J. Louise, woman! What is this? Family reunion? <sighs> okay. I'm not giving her nothing. A little fire scarecrow. Come on. Like, okay, that guy's just immune to fire, I guess. He wore his fireproof potion. I keep hitting the wrong button to open up my inventory. No. Okay, no, no, we're leaving, we're leaving, we're leaving. Leave! <laughs> She's pretty, pretty violent. Dude, I thought I genocide routed all these people. They're all back farming. Oh my gosh, dude. This is the worst day of my life. Oh, what the hell? They see me. What? I look away and then look back. They're all like, Oh my gosh, dude. 
We're eating the brown egg. I got one shotgun blast. They're like dispersing. I don't even remember where I'm supposed to go. What do I have now that I didn't before? Key treasures. What do I have? Ah, the key to the church. Stop. Just, just cut me some slack, man. It's my first day. Oh, shit. Run. Gee, dude, coming out the house for this? It's a whole event. Break him to pieces. Alright, you guys have fun. I'm going inside. Playing. It's been fun. I'm not feeling too well, guys. See you later. They're mad about the Axel. <laughs> my dad said no taking my Axel. Jerks. I don't know why, but this song always like made me depressed as a kid. There's something about the vibe of this, not this song, but saving song, but this. Hey, listen, this vibe too. It's a very, I don't know, it makes me feel lonely. It makes me feel sad. Like, this reminds me of, like, Silent Hill. Like this. It always gave me, like, lonely vibes. I don't know, it made me depressed. No, I, I like it. I just, like, always had a profound... What was all your hooks, dude? The spindle. There's a gemstone in there, that's why I shot it. It's a very claustrophobic place. It was a spinal spin. How are you still alive? Maybe that's his brother. <laughs> Got a selection of Got a selection of crazy shit. Let's sell selling? all our uh I don't need this because I don't like the machine gun in this game. Old stranger? Is that old? Is that old stranger, old stranger? <gasps> no, I don't wanna sell my big mouth Billy Bass. Yet. We'll see. Is that old stranger? <laughs> Thank you. Stranger. Do I have enough money for the big boy case? Yes, I do. <laughs> Woo! Now we can hold more fish! Now we're talking, chat. Alright. Nice doing business with you, bud. Peace to the east. Alright, I'm out of here. <laughs> he, he's just taking a nap, guys. <laughs> he's just sleeping it off. He's had a tough day. Don't you guys ever sleep face first in the puddle? <laughs> Face first, <laughs> breathing some nice H2O in his dreams. Face down in the water. <laughs> Quiet, we're going to church. We're getting married. Right? You guys would defile the sanctity of marriage. Leon and, and his fish compatriot need to give their uh, vows. Isn't this a beautiful day for a wedding? I love the weather. You weren't invited to my wedding, Enrique. Damn it. <laughs> no, no, stop, stop. You get another chance. Right in his jugular. <laughs> Velvet, 
I'm I'm glad you followed and you you're watching the stream. I feel like you fit in real well here. Uh, if you want, you can also oh gee, dude. Okay, who let Epic Man's mom in the game? Um, you could you could also join our Discord, where we uh, talk about all kinds of stuff all the time. Post a funny joke or something. Uh, feel free to join the Discord. Somebody do the Discord command for this poor individual. Thank you, Charlations. There's always something awful to see in that Discord. <laughs> Hey, thanks for the leaks. I like how all the other crows flew away, but this one badass, I'm gonna let him go. This one badass is like, I don't care about bullets. I grew up in Detroit. Think that'll scare me? Oh, cool. More. Come on, I'm so sick of these dynamite guys. Dynamite! No, stop, stop, please. Come on, it does so much damage. Why does grabbing Leon's shoulders, like, suck half his health up? <laughs> I'll do it in a second. I'll do it next time. Oh, no, no, no. Now Leon's holding his stomach like me. He's got bad acid reflux and esophagitis. Poor Leon. Oh, come on. No more dynamite. No, stop with the dynamite, please. No, no, bad. Bad man. How many bullets will it take? Okay, I'm out of here. Yeah, blow up your wife. Are you happy with yourself? You just blew up your own wife. Hopefully you're proud. I'm not doing this puzzles too hard. I don't want to. You gotta do like matching and twisting this and twisting that. We'll be here all freaking night. Yeah, I have GERD and LPR. That's what my doctor diagnosed me with. I also finally got, uh, I actually was able to contact my doctor's office and they were like, we are so sorry. When the doctor comes in tomorrow, we'll call you. I'm like, cool, while I'm at work, awesome. Haven't heard from you guys in weeks. Just wanna know if I'm dying or not. GERD is G-E-R-D. Yeah, -E I have GERD and LPR. That's what I was diagnosed with. And last, uh, in July, I had, it was actually so bad. My doctor said I had esophagitis. He said that there was erosion in my esophagus, which is why it burned so bad to talk. And he said that it usually takes about 90 days to heal and it's still kind of healing now. Yeah, it was, it was horrible. I was only able to stream two hours. Uh, and I only did, I was only able to stream two days a week for two hours because my throat would just burn like, I just swallowed like battery acid. It was horrible. I couldn't eat anything. I still can barely eat anything. I eat like oatmeal, avocado. I, I haven't eaten like red meat or I haven't eaten, you know, cheese or dairy Leon, have you reached in the months. Church yet? Uh, uh, they said mint is not good for me, but I, uh, honey, I drink it, honey a lot. They said mint isn't good because it uh, relaxes your like lower esophagus which lets more stomach acid come up. Honey's good, yeah, I've been having honey. They said, yeah, mint isn't good for what I specifically have, for my very specific thing. They said it's soothing to your stomach if you have something else. Like, if, if you have a sore throat, like, if you have, like, a sore throat, yeah, mint is soothing. If you have, like, an upset stomach, then mint is soothing. But when your problem is acid related, they said that it's not good because it can actually allow more acid. It will relieve your stomach, but then that acid will kick up into your esophagus and you'll get like throat issues, which is what I had the most. I wasn't really having much stomach problems. It was just chest pains and losing my voice and throat pains because when I would sleep, it would uh, screw me up. Uh, but I've been getting better, luckily. It's been a long, long road and I had to get a double biopsy. Two weeks ago, I went to the hospital to get a, uh, an endoscope where they put like, like a camera into my stomach and then they took two stomach samples and they're like, oh, we'll give you results in a few days. It's been two weeks now, still no results. So I had to call them and they said, oh, tomorrow. But I work like all day tomorrow. So I'm like, well, when the heck am I supposed to get these results, bro? No, stop, 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 stop. Stop throwing axes. Oh my gosh, dude, get down, fall down, go boom.
Yeah, that's what I've been doing. I've been taking those. But I, I don't... I'm trying to wean off of them because they're not really good for you either. Because they're, like, linked to, like, early kidney failure and dementia and shit. So I'm not trying to take them too long. They said the longer you take them, like, the... Oh, gosh, there's a snake in there. You asshole snake. Oh, I am. I'm, I'm gonna... I'm, uh... I'm gonna tell my boss. I'm like, hey, what if I get a phone call, I'm gonna have to take it. You little bastard. He bit me. I'm not being a jerk. He bit me. He deserves to die. He bit me. Right on the nipple. <laughs> For that, he must pay. <laughs> now I got his big snake egg. What? Chicken egg from the snake? Okay. A little sus. Yeah, right? Bro, chill. You you acting real hard for a guy who's got no backup. What do you think his last thought was as the life was leaving his eyes? Nightmare world. I don't think the flashbang works. I don't have a grenade, dude. Ah, uh, yeah, I don't have a grenade. If I did, I was gonna genocide all these crows at once. Told you crows not to come to school today! What did you get for bullying me? <laughs> Okay, you got some hard asses over here. Okay. Spooky. <laughs> All right, I just wanted some money. What's up, Foolish Buffet? Welcome to Month of Horror. Why do they give you money? Because their parents are freaking rich. Spoiled ass crows. Born with a silver spoon up their ass. All right. They didn't even work a, work a day for it. Gee, I wonder what's in here. Wait, I can hear something growling on the other side. Eh, it's probably nothing to worry about. A silver beak? That'd be a little more. We got cybernetic uh, crows. I've been having fun playing this game, chat. This is a good start to Month of Horror. Hopefully the other games can uh, live up to this. I've been having a blast. Hopefully you guys are enjoying watching the stream and... Uh, we're not doing a lot for October, but this is fun. This is fun. I'm, I'm having a good time. Having a good time. It's a little change of pace. You know, we're obviously going to go be going back to the old schedule in November. But it's a nice little just way to take a deep breath and, you know, enjoy some other stuff. See something else besides Mario jumping into bob Battlefield for the 900th time or, you know. Link swinging a sword. It's good. That's what the other 11 months of the year are for. You were so uninterested? Was it Resident Evil 4? I'm surprised. You would think a Res Resident Evil 4 is like what every young kid wants to play. It's like all violent, cool, it's actually a good game. If you're talking about Resident Evil 1, then whatever. Listen, I love Mario, but I'm glad we shake it up. Yeah, dude. I don't know how much more I can see Mario wearing a diaper or whatever. <laughs> What up, B? It's my good buddy. How are you? How was your nap? Got a selection of I need luck. I don't care about your blue medallions. What are you buying? Oh, snap. We got a rocket launcher. I ain't gonna buy nothing right now. Oh, hold up. Can I... I can level up something, right? What are you buying? Yeah, turn on my shark gun. Is that all? Hell yeah. <laughs> Thank you. All right, sweet. Peace. Poor Mario. How many healing things do I have? Do I have something? I have an egg, yes! Mm, yummy. 
I like eggs. I don't know why. I like them all kinds. Scrambled, hard-boiled, soft-boiled. What's up, Triple Eight? Welcome to uh, Month of Horror, dude. Play some Resident Evil 4. Gotcha. No, I understand that. That game is a lot for a kid. It's kind of boring for a kid. Because it's a lot of puzzles. It's very slow. It's not very action-packed. Um, I understand if you weren't interested in that. RE4, though, that was like... That was the game that all the cool kids were playing back in 2004. Alright, hold up. Every time you see one of these signs, you know something very uh, bad is going to happen. Uh, you're you're going to be in for a bad time. If you will. So. Can never, uh... Can never escape. Here we go. <laughs> oh shit, buddy. Hey, old buddy, old pal. <laughs> Not again. Alright, sorry. I think this game, but god, this control see I see I don't the controls don't bother me too much. The controls in like the older ones, like one, two, and three, those bother me. Um, but the control scheme, I got used to it. At first, I was like, how do I control this? But I, it connected with me almost immediately. Actually, no, I don't want to waste a... I don't want to waste a freaking um... Uh, sniper shell on this guy. There we go. <laughs> what a nerd, dude. We could, do you guys like the explosion behind the guy prank? Whoa, dude, we got the whole, like, Lord of the Rings novel in the chat. No, I'm kidding. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let me just... You know the go with your dad to the bank because he's high risk. Gotta protect him from the idiots who don't have any assumptions. Grandma. I'm used to that at my job, dude. I see that every single day at my job. I'm I'm like unfazed. Cause like every time I'm on every time I'm on the register at my job, every time people pay with cash, they always like lick their fingers to give me the money. And I was like, dude. Come on, bro. Don't lick, don't lick your finger and then give me the money. Weird ass. A little sus if you ask me, buddy. Another snake. Get out of here. No, I cut his egg. I didn't know you could do that. No, I, I could have used his egg as a healing. Oh, come on. Yeah, load. At least he was he was very polite and he allowed me to uh, reload my gun. That was very nice. That was very nice of him. Okay, that was not nice of him. Hey, bro, you know what I'm away with? Come on, dude. All these guys look like they're from, like... You guys ever seen those shitty-ass movies, Fifle? Think about that mouse who wants to come to America because he's a hard-working, like, European. I don't give a shit about his dumb-ass family. All these guys look like they're dressed like they're from Fifle. Fifle goes west. No, it's fine, Charlie. It's just because I always like just drop their food on the floor and shit, anyways. <laughs> so it doesn't even matter, bro. Fifel goes west. <laughs> oh, but I don't know. Right in the dingling. Come on, dude. How many knives? If a guy's slicing my throat, I'm probably. I'm, I'm not gonna walk towards him. If a guy's, like, slicing my, like, Adam's apple, I'm not gonna be like, Hello there, sir. This guy, these guys just don't get the memo. They just don't get it. I could really use a snake egg right about now. Come on. Back up, Jack. I'm trying to live my life. Oh man, we got a trip wired. You've never seen this game before? Can you describe it? Um Super racist American tries to genocide an entire European village. There you go. <laughs> No! Stop! What did that guy do? He's just dead-eyed looking at me. Now I'm dead. Okay, God dang it. <laughs> Who sent me a tag? <laughs> I 
No, this is Resident Evil 4. Um, local uh, goth boy Leon Scott Kennedy uh, is sent to a random part of Europe because the president's daughter has been kidnapped. So to investigate the whereabouts of uh, where the president's daughter may have been captive, he stumbles upon a village, but he realizes that the people in the village are not quite as they seem, and that something more dark and malicious is going on in this rural town. So you're uncovering the mystery of what could be going on in this village, and uh, it's not good. A lot of violence. And there's a guy with a chainsaw, and he follows you around, and he goes... Bleh, bleh, bleh. Yeah, I don't know. I, I mean, would you guys do whatever you guys are doing, but I don't really give a shit either way. <laughs> Come on, how did he see me? Evil Within. I played a little bit of Evil Within, but I never finished it. Quit screaming, dude. Yes, this time I got the egg. It was all worth it. No! I feel like I live in like a different reality than some of you guys in chat sometimes. Is there something in the water? Oh, probably money or something. Tentacle monster? I don't know what you're talking about. That's a different game. That reminds me of this other Resident Evil video that I saw. <laughs> Not for the easily squeamish. Come on, dude! Snake, every time, dude, can never just get, I, I take more damage from these snakes. What is this guy doing in the corner? He's in timeout. <laughs> Sony said the X button on the PlayStation is pronounced cross. I don't, dude, I don't give a shit about what Sony says. I don't give a shit, shit, shit. Where's my egg? Hell yeah, now we're living. <laughs> Motorboat. <laughs> what? You guys act, you guys all act big and brave. Alright? I wanna see where, when, when, when a, uh, inevitably a tentacle monster does show up, I wanna see all you guys front and center with the same energy when it's in front of you. Everybody, all, everybody always talks up a big game on the internet. Yeah, oh, I love it. Yeah, okay. And then one's up, and then everybody's, where's everybody at? I don't know, they're all gone now. Huh? They're, they're all hiding in their fucking house. <laughs> all right, that's fine. I'm calling one up right now. I, I want to see it. Put your money where your mouth is. <laughs> like that Resident Evil video I saw. <laughs> all right, hold up. Shut up. Don't you want to see a nice man going fishing? Look at shh. Leon's watching this. Oh, what are they doing? Oh, that, oh nice. Just an average day in, you know, New York. Shit. Vamanos. Vamanos. <laughs> What the hell, bro? Policia. Damn, son. What the hell? 
That was your husband that just got eaten? Or wait, you're talking about Delago? <laughs> Bro, I don't want to hear, I don't want to hear a chat ever roast me for thinking that Beatrice from Skyward Sword is cute. You guys are out here simping for Delago. What in the world? Oh my gosh. I'm stupefied. Okay, but like, when I think of monsters, I think of like, I don't know, like Toriel, or like Undyne, or Asgore, or something. I don't think of Delago. He's just a big mouth with like, <laughs> what in the world? He's not even like, he looks like a leech. He doesn't even have like facial features, let alone a humanoid appearance. This is a disgusting, Twitch chat is simping for Delago. The lake. That's what they call him because that's where he lives. That's where you guys are going to be living if you don't straighten up. No, shut up. I got to make some weed. In the shack. <laughs> combine, combine. Yes. I do miss being able to drink as much tea as I want because there's a lot of, like, I can't drink caffeinated teas anymore for, for a while because of my GERD and LPR and everything to let my throat heal. Uh, but I used to drink tea all the time, like, every, like, two cups a day. All right. Leanne, you feeling okay, buddy? It's kind of hopping along. See, look at the little fishies. They're cute, right? What? There's another in the chat? <laughs> Don't clump us together with velvet. There's more. There's got to be. Statistically speaking, seven out of a hundred people are attracted to Del Lago. Whoa. That's a little Easter egg. Never shoot the pond. All right. <laughs> That's a little Easter egg. If you shoot the pond, Del Lago will eat you. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't roast anybody because I have a tentacle related picture framed on my wall. Except it's not a monster, but I do have it in a real nice black frame hanging up on my wall. Kind of eat we talking? What? What the fuck? I should heal though, because this is not going to be. You're going to have a bad time, pal. Okay, right, cool. We're good. All right. Can we see it? Uh. Maybe on Discord. Maybe on Discord. It's just... I don't know if you guys know who Zone is. Zone Tom. She streams on Twitch. It's like a... It's like a character. It's an artist. Oh, yeah. Zone. It's Zone Tom sitting on a throne and the throne is made of tentacles. That's all it is. Here. I'll, I'll take a picture. I'll post it in the Discord. It's framed on my wall. It's just Zone sitting on a throne, but the throne is made of tentacles. I don't know. Shut up. Turn my light on. Shit. I'll take a picture. I'll put it in the Discord right now. The frame was more expensive than the image. I, I, I'm not gonna show it on, on Twitch. Just in case. I don't. I, I don't think it's like bad. I want to glare on the screen, so I'm gonna do it. For some dumbass reason, I went to take a picture, 
and even though I've never turned it on, my camera was set to a timer, so I had to stand there for five seconds like a douchebag because it, it was like five, four, three, two. I, I never why that. There's no there's no reason why my timer should be on. That was so stupid. I was like, what? So I had to stand there awkwardly in silence. I'll post it in uh, in the anime section. So if you guys are in the Discord and you want to see this picture, uh, what I'll post it in chat. Who cares? Never mind. I'll post it in chat. Also, I gotta give Velvet a roll now that they, now they can post pictures too. Why is everybody typing all at once? There's like five. There's more people typing in the Discord than are watching my stream right now. <laughs> Sorry. What do you mean the file size is too high, dude? Some bullshit. I'm also stalling so I don't have to fight this boss because this boss is very, very hard. For me. And I'm sure you guys are like, this is the easiest boss I ever fought in my life, Zach. You're, you suck and you should never be a streamer. Don't, don't ask, Charlations. People, Dally was posting some horrible stuff. How did I die before? Just randomly a guy picked me up and threw me. I'm trying to post my picture. It's a high uh, thing. You guys posted like vomit faces. All right, hold it. Right, here's here's my f picture, my framed picture of Zone sitting on the. It's it's a little bit lewd, but whatever. I like it. All right, we're good. There you guys go. It's in the Discord section. Um, but you probably won't make sense unless you know who Zone is, because she's cool. I think it's cool. <laughs> All right, back to the barnyard. You sure the game audio is not too loud? I feel like it's slapping out the speaker. But Zone is like super, super into tentacles, so that's why her she's got a tentacle throne. Scared, dude. Whoa, dude, he's coming out of here, man. Oh shit, he coming. <laughs> wrong, wrong guy. <laughs> All right, hold shut. Hurry, quiet. I gotta fight the Delago. He's crazy hard unless I'm paying attention. Get the fuck out the way! Move! 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 Alright. I suck at this boss fight. I've always sucked at this boss fight. Always have, always will. I used... No other boss like gives me as much trouble as this guy for some reason. He just looks like a big salamander. There we go. Leon, yeah, throw him faster! Faster, faster, faster! I hear him. I'm trying to turn. How much? He's the only other way. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. Oh, great. I threw it wrong. Nice. Gib kissed to him. How would you even kiss that? His mouth is like larger than your whole body. You wouldn't even know what's going on. Oh, great. Now Leon got freaking ejected from the passenger seat. Go, oh, he's coming! Dewey's rules of nature! Jeez. Stop impaling him, he's trying to kill me! You can't just mercy him. He's not Undertale. You can't just be like, hey, big monster, I I think we can resolve this, so just cut off your head. <laughs> oh, kind of hell on earth. In this world, it's kill or be killed. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like Georg a little bit. 
Except not as good. I can never like spear him because he's too busy like rolling in the deep. Okay. He's gonna build a. Oh god! Here. Durr! Why did Leon turn so slow? I'm coming. I'm coming. Okay. Okay. My word. How many spears does it take, dude? Spearing them like freaking a shish kebab. Wow, I actually beat him first try. Never mind, Chad. I'm the uh, Resident Evil expert. No need to thank me. I have a ballroom with no balls. Is that like a ball pit? I like ball pits, but they're ruined because they're usually open to the public. So like kids like shit and piss in them all. Oh gosh. But if I, like, had my own ball pit that, like, only me and, like, people I knew could use, that'd be pretty sick. Let's make a ball pit. At 500 subs, we'll do a ball pit stream. How would I even do that? Can you buy, like, a... Bunch of balls. <laughs> Dash con, dude. I wish I would have gone there. Oh gosh, Leon's tripping out, dude. For 200 bucks, you're gonna play in a ball pit. It's like a kiddie pool filled with shit. You'll join me in the ball. It's gonna be a pretty sad one. I don't have that nice of a house to make a one. <laughs> that Gerd's hitting him really hard. Yeah, that was, that was me in July when I could stream for two hours. It's like, my fucking bro. I'm just on a liquid diet. Wake up, Leon. <laughs> Slink. Dang, dude. Oh my gosh, bro. Classic quirky Leon. It's <laughs> just too fun. Oh, man. Where's everybody going, bingo? It's been six hours sleeping, lazy ass. I was starting to get worried. Don't you mean lonely? Anyway, I started to feel dizzy, and then I guess I must have lost consciousness. Well, we'll just got a little thirsty. A little dehydrated. Classic Leon moment. 2020, 2012 Tumblr kids? I'm going to continue my mission. I never had a Tumblr, and then I made a Tumblr for one week. I had a Tumblr for one week, and that's when they, like, banned, like, all, like, pornographic images, and then nobody used it anymore, and then I just didn't want to use it because nobody used it anymore. I had no friends that used it. Everybody stopped using it. So it's like, well, I had one for a week. I don't even remember my login shit. I, I was just like, well... I only, everybody, all my friends, all my friends were always just like, dude, add me on Tumblr, I, I, I like, add me this or that. I was like, okay, fine. And then I, I, then I did, I was like, hey guys, do you still use it? Like, no, I don't want to use it anymore. I'm like, what can I make this shit for that, dude? Everything's just gone now. All right, whatever, we moved on. Your Tumblr was hacked and it was full of porn. <laughs> oh my gosh. Your tumbler was hacked. Oh my gosh, dude. I wasn't on that site long enough to even know, like, what it was like, honestly. 
what made it special like what why did people use that over like anything else i didn't get it i never got the appeal it felt too zoomer to me yeah like why do people hack tumblr no one's gonna put their like bank information on there i wasn't even tumblr famous oh shit now it's nighttime dude You're gonna clickbait me? This just doesn't make any sense. This is stupid. I guess it's still better than Twitch getting hacked and everybody like I'm that's like the one time I'm glad I'm not a big streamer is because like all of like the top like 200 streamers like their addresses were leaked their bank account was leaked their how much their maid was leaked I was like, what the fuck is going on, dude? <laughs> well, right, if I was them, I'd be suing their ass, bro. Like, what? What's poppin', G? Got some rare things on sale. Got some rare shit you ain't Only gonna see no way, eh, say. Not enough cash. Not enough money? Can I sell you some stuff? What are you selling? Bro? Is that all, stranger? Is Welcome to the underground. I was the fall. Spin. Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. I forget that I have a TikTok, and I just uploaded to it yesterday. <laughs> it's cause like I don't post like TikTok stuff on TikTok. I just post like my Twitch clips. So I'm just kind of like, and then like it goes on. I, I don't really put much thought into it, and then I copy paste it to YouTube. Milky Clipperers. Who's your favorite character? Sans the skeleton. <laughs> I would I went to upgrade, but then he was like, you don't have enough cash, Stranger. What are you buying? Not enough cash, Stranger. Dude, I'm looking, I'm so close. I'm like less than 200 pinatas away from being able to buy this shit. What can I sell? What else can I sell? Oh, uh, you know what, chat? Think it's I think we gotta say goodbye to Big Mouth Billy Bass. Why every time I'm in here, Sans is brought up? It's a curse, Robo Pig. I don't know why, okay? Dude, we d I can't upgrade my shotgun without it. What else can I sell? I don't want to sell my healing items. Bro, he's taking up the whole suitcase. He's going to have a better home with Sub-Zero. I can't treat him the way he needs to be treated. He'll be much happier with Sub-Zero. I'm telling you guys, it's for the best. Oh, hold up. No, flash, grades, flash grenade's not going to be enough. What are you buying? I don't, I want... Dude, I don't have, I have nothing selling? else. I'm not selling my flame man. Alright, we're selling them. It's good fish smell. He's alive in our hearts. He's not gonna die. You guys are acting like I'm killing him. We're just dropping him off at a no-kill shelter. We're not killing him. We're giving him to another home. He, he is a good boy. He'll be a good boy with somebody else looking after him. Sending him to the farm? Don't worry. Oh my gosh. Fine, I won't sell them. We'll just have a weaker gun. All right, happy birthmas. <laughs> Peace. I'll be back later. <laughs> well, now we can never sell him because he's dead. Now we're just screwed. Hopefully you guys are proud of yourselves. Now when we can't fight any guys because we have no way to strengthen our guns, it's going to be all your fault. Consider it a challenge, yeah. Look at this guy. Look at him. Hey buddy, you doing okay?
You guys ever see the anime Parasite? That's literally what these guys turn into. What's that song? It's like... Can you stop doing some goofy shit? Please! So hard to shoot him. It's all wiggly. There he's dead. Chill out. Got 500 bucks. Oh, what? Dude, now I would have had enough to get the upgrade. Yeah, it's not. It's more body horror than, like, it's not a scary. It's more psychological. You know? It's more of like a thriller than a horror anime. Time to rappel down this cliff. <laughs> it's fine, okay? I tell you, we're gonna be streaming a full playthrough of this. This is a one-time month of horror deal. Speaking of which, guys, if you like our streams and you want to catch up on all the stuff that we do, feel free to subscribe to us on YouTube, where we have funny moments to show your family. Also, we have a second YouTube channel where we have the full uncut streams, including tonight's stream, so if you miss anything you want to watch it, it's on the second channel. Uh, so yeah, subscribe. Or do the Clips one. Yeah, the Clips channel is good too. We got too many channels. Half your guys' subscription feed is going to be my garbage. Whoa, where did you come from? Dang, dude. A little close. A little rough, don't you think? Subscribe now and you'll be a certified big shot. Be a big, be a big, be a big shot. Okay. Uh, what? There should be enough to jump across, right? No? Drunk. Please, you son of a bird. Hey, hey, Paisanos, it's a Super Mario. Wow, it only lets you jump over when you have all the boxes done. It's a little goofy. Um, yes, I will need this for when the time is right. I got a lot farther uh, in this stream than I thought I would. Who knows, maybe Month of Horror will continue where we left off here. If you guys still watch my dumbass stream, be like, Hey, it's Month of Horror 2022. Uh, we're just continuing where we left off. Where were we? I don't remember. But it's actually been fun as hell to play this game again. Uh, so to answer the question, does this game hold up? Yeah. I'm having just as much fun playing this as I did before. I'm having just as much fun playing this as I did, so absolutely. Previously on Month of Horror. Statistically speaking, some of you may not live to see Month of Horror next year. <laughs> All right, here comes, here comes the goon squad. Out of my way, douchebags. How about a little fire? Oh, I'm gonna die. Um, yeah, I could use this. A move. Rusted gears makes you happy. Oh. Something for everybody. Take the round insignia? Yeah, let's do it. I've obtained an object that resembles the cult group's insignia. I forgot that this whole thing was about a cult group. I was just thinking about monsters and farmers. Like, Leon's like, what do you mean they were infected? <laughs> I was just killing guys. Thought it was fun. 
hey, this is the highest quality receptor that he can get. This is not your T-Mobile ass reception. Leon's got like connections to the president. He's got the highest quality stuff money can buy. Hey, we're back. Is Sub Zero still dead from when I killed him last time? You live in here, bud? Hey, see, it's good. Let's see if I can upgrade my thingamajig now. What up, B? Got a selection of good. What are you buying? Is that all <laughs> See, everything worked out in the end. Peace out, dude. Oh, hold on. Let me see. Come and pays his phone bill. Hey. This game takes place, I think, in 2004. So you're one year off. It's a happy mass salesman. Seems you've met with a terrible fate. <laughs> Peace out. All right, we go into the surface now. You got Metro PCS. You deserve to have your shit, your calls drop, bro. Was that one buck a month? <laughs> Some fucking whack ass phone bill. Or herb. He wants our faces. I don't think the happy mass salesman wants to rip off. Was he? He's definitely not Leatherface. Right. Remember that big door I was talking about? Now it's coming into play. Rapido, rapido. Look at them all. What is going on here, dude? They're bringing out the big guns now. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Looks like you're in for a bad time, pal. <laughs> <laughs> get dunked on. <laughs> Dude, that guy get you get dunked on, bro. Oh snap! This is dead ass like Lord of the Rings. Best boss fight ever, dude. You can feel your sins crawling on your back. Oh my gosh, dude. This is like Sans if his mom and dad were like brother and sister. <laughs> this is inbred Sans. Peekaboo. Hey, how many shots did it take? <laughs> Come on, buddy. It's the dog! Get him. See? If we would have done the genocide route and killed the dog, this cutscene wouldn't happen. Yeah, you better... Yeah, kill the dog and not me. <laughs> you shoot him right at the ass. Bruh. Ugly ass motherfucker. Please. Oh, Leon, get that yellow weed really quick. Where the hell? <laughs> this is a scuffed ass fight. What the pamphlet said to do? Said there's nothing that cannot be resolved without kind words. Whoa! <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my gosh, what was the timing on that, dude? Somebody clipped that. Holy shit, my guy.
Oh my, does this, does flashbang even work on this slow brain? It does. <laughs> We're using pistol ammo. Spare that shit, son! Load up! Load up! Load up! Oh my god, dude. How many shots, my guy? Well, I guess it would help if I landed some of them, right? Uh, right in his face. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Come on. How many shots do you need to get? Gee Louise, bro. Yeah, it's fine. We're fine. Everything's fine. Okay, I think this thing where the tentacle comes out of his back. Can I just see with my eyes where he is? Oh, you guy had no time at all! That gave me no time to shoot it! He gave me no time to even shoot it. I have no more ammo, dude. This guy's a real dick. You know that? You got a tree branch now? Whoa, what the fuck? <laughs> Bro, what the hell, dude? You play baseball? I didn't even see half these moves in my life. The power of kind words. Be polite. Use your words. You can't get me. I'm safe in here. Jeez. <laughs> get him, pupper. Load up! Lo reload! Did you pick the worst time to reload every time, Leon, you ass clown? I... He's invincible. What is he doing? I am gonna have no bullets left after this. Every bullet I've ever conceived of is, like, gone. Yeah, good shot, right? Is he still alive? What the fuck? I thought he was dead. I thought that was it. What the hell? I'm out of bullets. <laughs> I've got my, my microphone fell down. Dude, I've got no more bullets. Oh my word. Oh my gosh. Use the fish. All right. I always knew you'd come in handy, my friend. Using the power of the fish. Can we stop him? I'm not so sure. Because pistol bullets, he doesn't care about. You shoot him with a pistol, it's like a freaking fruit flies flying into him. He doesn't care. Jeez. <laughs> so he needs a compilation of just Leon getting his ass whooped by this guy. How many, like, across the area attacks can happen to Leon? Holy shit! Without that fish, we would have been smoked. Holy shit! That was not a that was not an easy fight. That was just Leon getting gaster blasted against the wall. His back's gonna be broken. Well, cool. I have like nothing now. No ammunition. Everything is wiped. My entire inventory is just absolutely wiped. For eternity. The real, yeah, the real ammunition was the friends I met along the way. back buddy no he's still <laughs> he's still uh oh he's gone oh shit okay interesting oh 
<sighs> well, on that note, I hate to do it to you guys, but I think that is where we will wrap up tonight. I have an opening shift in the morning at my job, and I gotta eat dinner before it gets too late. Uh, so I'm just gonna eat some dinner. I know, it's been fun! It's been a fun time. It's been a great time. Uh, but that, that concludes the first month of horror stream. I had a fun time. There were so many stories and funny moments, and uh, if you missed it, the uh, highlight version will be up on, the, on our main channel in a few days. All right? Uh, I will see you next time. We're going to be streaming some other games as well, but there are still more month of horror streams to come. So uh, feel free to tune in. And I uh, thank you to every new follower or sub or donator or anybody. I appreciate all of you. Um, and I will see you next time. Feel free to join the Discord, subscribe on YouTube, or most importantly, tune into the next live stream. Because that's where the most fun happens, right? So super fun time. And I'll see you guys uh, for more Month of Horror and just more streams in general.